It is time once again for the Spelunky Daily Challenge. Based on suggestions from some comments, I decided to warm up by starting on level three in the ice caves. Try to see if I can get to the mothership. I'm gonna try to uh, break into here. See if there's anything good in this crate. Ropes, I'll take it. And I think I did about 10 practice sessions in level three. About half the time I didn't even make it out of 3-1. Did manage to get myself a hold of a shotgun once or twice, but never made it to the mothership. It's very hard to start with no items in the ice caves, at least at the level of skill that I'm at. So then I did some normal uh, practice uh, starting in the mines and I got to the black market. And so yeah, I feel like I have some confidence for today's daily, hopefully. But we will take things as they go. Won't we, Damsel Doggy? Uh, Damsel Doggy signals his ascent with kind silence. And I'm not gonna bother going after that gold. I won't spend a rope on it. Let's see, is Damsel Doggy gonna be safe down here? Let's take a look. Uh, reasonably safe. Is there anything I can do to make him safer? Uh, yes. Let's do this. This should work. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, it didn't work. <laughs> Sorry, Damsel Doggy. I didn't mean for you to get hit by the arrow trap. But I tried. Damsel Doggy's still alive. He should be still okay. Provided I don't screw anything else up over here. Let's see. Uh, the bat is the main threat. There's one bat. And there's the other bat. Great! Look at that. And I will pick up this little tail of an arrow to carry forward to the next level in case I need to set off another arrow trap by dropping it in front. Snake pit! Alright, so there's a matic pickaxe down there somewhere. We have a Kali altar. Any signs of the key or lock chest? Not so far. So it seems somewhat unlikely that they'll be here. So I guess I'll head down into the snake pit. Just in Oops, sorry, damsel doggy. I didn't mean to hit you. Uh, ooh, this is gonna be rough. Let's see if I can use this to set off that arrow trap. Before we head down here, try to keep damsel doggy alive. Oops. And yeah, this isn't so bad. All right, I can do this, I can do this. Great, Damsel Doggy's alive. I can get a Matic over there, which is worth a bomb. There we go. All right, Damsel Doggy. Uh, let me pick up the Matic. All right, don't worry about that in a minute. Actually, I need it right now. Let's take a peek over here. Oh, oh that almost just fell on me because I was not paying enough attention. All right, it'll block the arrow from the arrow trap, though, so that's nice. Anything over here? Uh, just another arrow trap. Might as well get this money since I'm over here. I don't see any signs of the locked key. Or the locked key. The locked key. The key is in a lock. Um, the locked chest. And so, I think we'll just be moving forward with the Matic. Uh, it's a very valuable item, especially when I'm down to two bombs. Uh, that'll allow us to dig around and get through some walls. Possibly even carry it all the way to the black market if uh, things work out that way. But I don't have enough mobility that I'm going to try to ghost this level with a Matic or anything crazy like that. So let's just move forward. And see what the next level has in store for us. Another Kali altar. Some interesting stuff over here. I wonder if I jump on the spider at the right moment, his blood might ignite the uh, explosive trap over there. Nope. All right, I thought I would just take a try, just in case it gave me, granted me more access to that level than I would normally otherwise get. Let's go ahead and kill some other things, like you and you, just in case. All right, more ropes. Okay, there is a, what do you call there? And we got a damsel doggy over here. All right, and I have the Matic still, right? Let's use the Matic to get the damsel doggy, and I've already got six hearts. And so damsel doggy is gonna take a magical wild trip 
uh, to a far away unknown land. And so, have a good trip, damsel doggy. <laughs> uh, and we get some paste. All right. Kali is very happy to have a live sacrifice. This also looks dangerous. Okay, the blood did not ignite that. So we'll just continue on past. Okay, I did a very good job there. Okay, spider here. It's gonna cause me some trouble. So let's avoid that trouble. Let's not make it double. Okay, the explosions didn't go off. Oh, there's the, okay. Here's this. Where is the other piece? There's the key. Okay, great. That actually works out reasonably well. What am I gonna throw over there? Hmm. How am I gonna set this one off? I could do it using another bomb. I could probably use the Matic, actually. Uh, will I be too close? Hmm. Like, if I do that, oops. That! <laughs> oh boy. That! Ugh. Yeah! Alright, it still didn't set it off. Um, oh, I can just push those, can't I? Yes. Here we go, here we go, here we go. So let me do this. Blam. And then if I throw something at that snake, I think we'll be okay. Can I find something I can throw at the snake, though? Now is the next question. Oh boy. Um. I have a problem. Oh dear, I... Ugh. Things are not working in my favor. I have 10 ropes. It's time to start using them. Uh, okay, so here is an arrow that I could throw at the snake later. Uh, but now I have to worry about the ghost. In fact, let's get the ghost up nice and super high. Oh, that was close. Okay. Oh! Does the ghost set off? No, he would have gone through there. I was gonna say, does the ghost set off explosions? That'd be kind of interesting if you did. All right, I'm down to one bomb, but I still do have a Matic pickaxe that I could potentially use um, somewhere. I don't remember exactly where to, oh darn it, here comes the ghost again. Ah. All right, I am not doing this optimally. Okay, the Matic is still over there. Let's remember that. Let's get the ghost up nice and high again, and this time, Actually, can I get the ghost up even higher? Hmm. I don't remember if I set off that arrow trap. All right, let's try this. Let's see if I can get my arrow into the snake. There we go, and set off. Okay, good. All right, so that's step one. The key is now accessible. I'm gonna need to bring the Matic back down here, but first off, we have to get around the ghost once again. So I want to lead the Matic by the exit so that I can get to it. Yeah, let's bring the sky all the way over here, I guess. And then I could just, uh, let's do this actually. That's actually pretty good. That'll, okay, I'm gonna cycle back around like that. That sounds like a plan. That'll give us easier access to the key, in which case I can actually just leave the ghost over here. Can I get over him over here? Oh dear, all right, I can get under him though. Now I can go get the key. All right, this was, took a bit of time, took a bit of juking, but we're getting it done. All right, I have Ujot, we're out. Great, 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 great. We're low on bombs, but we still have the Matic. We haven't angered shopkeepers, and uh, we have one bomb still, and now we have the I have Ujot. And so, all right, we have a shop that doesn't have bombs in it. So, we're going to not anger shopkeepers so that we can hold on to the Matic. Ooh, that was dangerous. I almost displaced the idol. Oh, there's another. I can get a fresh Matic in here. Interesting. Um, do I want to do that? Sure. Let's do that. Oh, except for there's a, hmm. Maybe I'll just rescue Damsel Doggy? Hmm. Yeah, let's just rescue Damsel Doggy. All right, so I'm gonna drop this Matic down here. Yeah, we're gonna play nice and safe, I think is what we're gonna do here, because I don't even see any crates anywhere. Uh, that will, yeah, get caught in the... All right, Damsel Doggy, you stay safe right there. The arrow gets caught in the cobweb. I am going to look down here a little bit. 
But I want to avoid the spiders since I'm not very good at them. Yeah, I don't see any crates. Let's just get out of here. We made it to the jungle. We have a Matic and one bomb. We have the Eye of Ujot. The goal, as always, is just get to the black market. And from there, everything else can solve itself. More bombs. Great. It's a very good find. Uh, I should probably take a look over here just in case the black market entrance is over here. It is not. There are no ticking sounds being emitted by the Eye of Ujot. So we will continue downwards. Here's a friendly damsel. Hmm. Damsel is possibly going to have a rough time here. Let's go ahead and drop this down. Let's drop this down as well in case it becomes valuable. No, it ends up over there. That's fine. Damsel dog is going to have a tough time staying alive. Actually, the most likely thing to keep him alive will be to do that. Uh, because the little fishies in there don't like to go after him. And then I can kill the fishies like this. Great. Damsel dog, he's alive. Great. Alright. The bat got killed. But, oh crap! <laughs> oh. Alright, that could have gone much worse for me. Still no signs of the black market entrance. Um, Worried about the piranha plant here. I think let's do this. The exit over here? The exit isn't here yet. What happens if I break this? I'm not sure how that guy walks around. I'm afraid bad things will happen. Alright, I'm gonna drop this down. I'm gonna drop Damsel Doggy down. Is Damsel Doggy gonna be safe over on the left? Yes. Okay, so Damsel Doggy, you go down there. I'm wielding a fish. Look out, world. I've got a fish and I know how to use it. Like this. Kablam! Alright, this is safe. All right, no signs of a black market entrance. Can I throw a fish at this guy? Oops, not effectively. Uh, what happened to the other fish? It's over here. Let's grab this and see if I can hit this monkey. There we go, great. Okay, with the monkey out of the way. Hmm. All right, damsel doggy, you ready for an exciting ride? Woo! Oops, threw him the wrong way. <laughs> Woo! There we go. Oh, no, we turned around. Don't go that way. Oh, shoot. Okay, he's going to the right. It's going to be okay. Oh, no, there's a Ziki trap there. I tried so hard to save Damsel Doggy, but it didn't work. Uh, sometimes. Oh, okay. Oh, gosh. Sometimes that's just how these things go. All right, we're moving forward. We did not miss the entrance to the black market there. We didn't manage to successfully rescue Damsel Doggy, despite many heroic efforts. We still have our Matic, and we still have four bombs, we got paste, and seven ropes. You need not to forget about the ropes, I don't utilize ropes enough, especially when I have multiple of them. Alright, no signs of the black market up here. Might as well take this as a projectile, if nothing else. Um, I'll just drop it down here for now. Let's grab our Matic. And... All right, I hear Damsel Doggy. Let's take a quick look over here. Nothing too exciting. Ooh, except, all right, there is something exciting. I see a, a crate. A crate of Destiny. Don't know if it's actually a crate of Destiny, but sounds sounds poetic and exciting. Yeah, more ropes, all right. That's good. Let's be very willing to spend ropes because we have a lot of them. And then I left uh, the idle head over there. Which is worth a fair amount of money. So let's, let's, hmm. Yeah, let's go ahead and drop this down. Let's grab the idol. Continue down to the next level. I'm gonna jump on this guy just for fun. Alright, I think I can stun that guy. So that'll deal some damage to him. Going. Oops, oh, there's, there's a piranha! I didn't see the piranha! Oh, they're so well hidden sometimes. Alright, I don't see... <laughs> Alright, that stuns him as well. And then I can knock him down here. Alright. And he's almost dead, I think, the piranha plant. 
All right, still not seeing any signs of the black market. I'm gonna go ahead and free this gem. Just because I feel like it. All right, there's the exit, the normal exit. Let's leave the Matic there. Uh, and let's carry this around. Um, if I hit you again, you're still not dead. That's annoying. We'll go ahead and get that to the exit. And then very briefly, let's look to the right. I know Damsel Doggy's over here. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get to him very easily. There is another crate over here that could be worth going after. And since I have a great tool for going after it, might as well. More ropes. Okay, so many ropes. Oh, now I can rescue Damsel Doggy. Hey, um, that works out pretty nicely. Um, Damsel Doggy, come with me. Where's the ghost? Hopefully he's coming from the right. The ghost is coming from the left. I'm in trouble. All right, Damsel Doggy, you go home. Grab our Matic that still has not fallen apart. At some point it's gonna break, but not yet. And 2-3, this has gotta be the level that has the black market now. And so, very willing to spend ropes. Okay, no signs of it over here. Let's be very careful with the spikes. All right, Piranha really scare me, and so I'm gonna do this, just so that they all die. Cause they need water to survive. It's their one weakness. <laughs> All right, I hear Damsel Doggy. There's a skeleton, just in case somehow he like wakes up and tries to come down after me. We'll do that. No signs of the black market entrance over here. Uh, let's go ahead and jump on this guy's head again. I'm gonna go ahead and drop that down there because I plan to head down there, but let's grab this on the way out. Jump on this guy one more time. All right, can I drop that on your head? No. I can probably jump on your head, though. You don't have a weapon. Actually, I can just pick up this weapon. <laughs> uh, which could be useful against guys like this. Oops, maybe. <laughs> Not all that familiar with exactly how the boomerang moves. So I gotta be careful with it. All right, where's the crazy black market entrance? All right, I've got plenty of ropes. So I can head back up if I need to. Um, I also, I have a few bombs, and I might end up using them. We're going to use the Matic to dig around through the rest of this level, I think. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. Let's, like, dig down into this corner. Here we go. Tick. There it is. I don't know why I just used a bomb rather than using the Matic. But whatever. Um, the idol's over here, and Damsel Doggy's over here, and we can get all these things. Hold on. I like it when those things come out at relatively the same time. Alright, and I guess I haven't angered shopkeepers. So, we'll be going in with shopkeepers not yet angry, which could work for or against me. And I guess I'll bring the Matic forward. It's not going to be too useful to me, so I guess I'll try to grab a little bit of gems before I do so. Since we have a little bit of time. Grab this green gem. And any other easy money to go after? Uh, not that I see. Alright, let's go on in. And see what we can manage to do here in a peaceful black market. Now, it could be the case that there's frogs that are going to explode or whatever. Which could turn the tables. Okay, this is not too bad. I'm going to take a risk uh, like this. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to have a place to stand right here. I'm going to leave the mattock here. This is dangerous. Okay. Okay, we at least got the shopkeepers angry. I have a gun of some sort. Doesn't shoot very far. Oh dear! Ah! Alright, I'm still alive. And there could be other good weapons over here, so let's check out what we got. Uh, there's a happy damsel. That's nice. And there's probably gonna be a shotgun somewhere. Yeah, there's one. How many bombs do I have right now? Three. But I still have the Matic. And can I encourage these guys to go die somewhere, maybe? Oh, and I have that, uh, I have that, uh, ice gun thing. 
All right, I hear guys taking more damage down, and I've got the boomerang. I have I have a lot of assets. Let's try to make use of them before the ghost arrives. Okay, so that guy is dead. Down here. I think I'm gonna end up spending bombs on this anyway, so let's do. It's a risk, but let's do one, two. Oh boy! No! Oh, no! Ah, oh, that actually worked in my favor. All right, great. Just gotta be shotgun down here somewhere. Right? Here it is. Got it. All right, I got a shotgun now. Okay, let's not shoot damsel doggy. All right. I still don't have that many assets, but now I have a shotgun. Okay, let's deal with the bat first. Shopkeeper next. Okay, my assets are growing in numbers. Got a cape. Uh, hired help is probably dead down there. Was there anything worth getting down there? Otherwise, I might take a shortcut. Uh, climbing gloves I already have. Okay, great. Um, where was the mattock? Is it still up here? I don't remember what I did with it. And Damsel Doggy's still over here, too. Uh, oh boy. Alright, I could use the mattock to get down there, but now we have the ghost as a problem. I'm not certain what my strategy is right now. Damsel Doggy, if there's any chance of you getting to the exits, you're gonna have to do some of the work on your own. So we're gonna go ahead and get Damsel Doggy over there. I've got ropes aplenty, so let's start spanning them to get the ghost up nice and high. And I think I might be able to dig down with the mattock. Hmm. Oh, and I've got climbing gloves now, so let's make sure that they don't surprise me. Oh, crap! <sighs> Quit climbing ladders. I just want to move to the right. I don't want to go up. Okay, here we go. Uh, where'd the... Oh, no, the mattock just broke. Crap. All right. And I do not have jetpack. Okay, but I do have climbing gloves. Okay. So... All right, we're going to do the same thing again. We're going to have to go down to the bottom... There's still shopkeepers alive at the bottom. We're going to have to kill them and move to the right through the normal entrance. I still only have one bomb, which is a huge problem. Uh, but we'll deal with what we can deal with. But for right now, now is probably a good time to go. Okay. Hi, Damsel Doggy. I'm sorry that you didn't get to the exit, but at least you're still alive and safe. Okay, there's a shopkeeper. He seems stuck. Oh! All right, we're out. <laughs> oh, boy. Just happy to be alive. All right, we accomplished our first goal. Now let's hope magically there will be a shop with tons of bombs here. Ooh, Kali Altar. This could be really good. Uh, shopkeeper already died somehow. Any chance that I'm going to ghost this level? It's a possibility. So let's kind of keep our options open with respect to gems and things. Ooh, boy. <laughs> that was a little bit more uh, fraught with peril than I intended. Does that mean that skeleton's alive since this uh, skull and bones are bouncing around? Oh, I should be trying to uh, use the Kali Altar here somehow. Okay, where is... Okay, the shopkeeper, I guess, already killed himself, so I can just shoot these guys. Uh, except for I want their corpses. So let's grab a corpse. Let's see, the shopkeeper is, he fell out of the, oh, I see, blew up. Okay, great. Um, yeah, and here's more useful corpses. Okay, great. Um, all right, so the Kali altar sadly is way up there, but there's another shotgun over there right by the exit. And I have so many ropes that we are just gonna rope our way to victory. Oops. <laughs> all right. Great, great, great. Okay, so we are going to get a whole bunch of corpses on the Kali altar. And I can't remember, have I done anything with Kali before in this game? I've lost track. I'm going to pick this up because I'm worried that it's going to... Oh, I got a pitcher's mitt, apparently. I did not realize I had that. Okay, I have a pitcher's mitt. I've got climbing gloves. I've got a parachute. I've got spiky boots, but not jumpy boots. And I've got paste and a compass. Looking at all my items over in the top left. Okay, I don't plan to ghost this level, so let's go ahead and grab that. And... All right, so we got another dead body over here we can give to Kali. 
And so I don't think it's worth sacrificing. It is worth sacrificing the Amstel Doggy because I have the Ankh and I'm gonna have to die in the Moai head soon. Oh boy, oh, ugh. oh, okay. Oh boy. <laughs> I've come very nearly, come very close to blowing myself up a number of times. Oh, we got Kali's Cup already. Okay, I guess I did make sacrifices earlier that I don't remember. All right, so that's really good. Um, all right, and there's a shotgun over here. All right, I think we should just be happy with what we've got thus far. And move forward moments before the ghost would have arrived. That's right, we said Damsel Doggy to a very happy, happy place on his own little adventure. All right, he's up there right now. Let's leave him there. Okay, the top of this level's pretty empty. I have plenty of ropes. I might begin to use. All right, we have lots of dangers here. Let's see. Let's do this. Great. And then I've got spiky boots, and I might be able to get some blood from these woolly mammoths. Okay, I don't know that I got any blood, but that's okay. Okay, the shopkeeper's down here. There are a variety of ways that I could get his attention, but here is one that should be safe. Great. Okay, hopefully I got a little bit of blood from that, maybe. And here's another guy who can give me a little blood, maybe. All right. And then I think, was there another Kali altar in this level? Because I could get a lot more blood from sacrificing corpses then, potentially. Let me go take a look and see if I was remembering that there's a Kali altar. I don't think I've seen the Moai head, so the Moai head must be coming up on 3-3. We're taking advantage of our ropes. Right, Damsel Doggy was way up here, okay. Uh, but I don't see the Moai, or sorry, I don't see a Kali altar, okay. So I'm misremembering that. Okay, so in that case, is there a way for me to run through here? I'm not sure what there is. Uh, I don't really need those ropes. So we're gonna get Damsel Doggy to the exit and then continue on, I suppose. I could get tiny amounts of gems by exploding some more gems out of the walls, but I still am not in super great shape for survival, and so I'm gonna continue to focus on survival. Look at Damsel Doggy's breath. He's so cold here in the ice caves. You can see him forming steam or water vapor in front of his mouth. All right, so 3-3, this is gonna be the level that we're gonna die. We have seven hearts. Uh, and so rescuing Damsel Doggy just gave us some kind of insurance before we're quite ready to die. Blow up various things. I do see a lot of gems. So this could be a ghostable level. More ropes, so many ropes, so few bombs. Be interesting to see how some other folks play this one, I think. Ooh, okay. Uh, all right, we need to try to get in there, so let's do this. Can I do this? Hmm. This is gonna be tough. I would like to get into that vault. I think. Hmm. Alright, lots of gems around. This would be a good level to go, since so getting into the vault would be good. Is there another uh, landmine that I can use? Because I've only got the one bomb, is the problem. We can take risks, because I have the Ankh and I need to die in this level anyway. Oops, alright, well, there's one unintended risk. Oh, I could have used uh, the alien spacecraft, actually, as a... Oh, crap! Forgot all about this guy. All right, he's dead. The other guy's angry. Um, hi, little penguin. Thanks for the blood. Oh, darn it, I completely filled my cup. I was trying to get it just, just below being filled for exiting this level. Okay, let's carefully shoot this guy. There we go, got a bit of blood there. Uh, Damsel Doggy's over here. I do want to get Damsel Doggy to the exit, definitely. 
and I'm capable of doing so. Cape will help a lot. Capable, cape, uh, uh. All right, and now there was a, there was a, uh, yes, this thing right here. This is the key to my victory. All right, and then how am I gonna get up there? I've got so many ropes, so let's just start spending them. Okay, and now we're gonna take a risk. Uh, let's put it right here. Okay, he will be able to get out, but let's see if I can go kill him and then get to all the gems. Uh, we'll even try to kill him with this, for funsies. And if I happen to die, I happen to die. All right, but can I stun him with this? And then get him like that, and then... No! Oh, I picked up all the gems anyway. All right, let's hope the ghost doesn't end up in the Moai head when I die here. Because that could be a real problem. Okay, I don't see the ghost on the screen right now. But we needed to die anyway. We did pick up the gems that were in the vault, even if we uh, died in the process. We weren't able to ghost the other gems in the level. Uh, but all in all, things are still not going badly. I guess anytime you're alive uh, and have managed to get the head jet, that is a reason for some mild celebration. All right, Mothership's going to be over to the right. Uh, let's focus on trying to get to the shopkeeper and earn ourselves a shotgun or see if there's a shop along the way that would like to give us one. Right, I keep forgetting I have the pitcher's mitt. Oh boy. Uh, which is actually going to turn in super useful because I'm going to do this. Ah, oh, I just missed him. Darn it. Ah, darn it. All right. I do not like those alien spacecraft. In case you weren't sure. Oh, can I? Hmm. Is there a way? I feel like I might be able to... Yeah, here's what I can do. I can get a corpse, and I think I can get the corpse down on the landmine that is above the shopkeeper there. Oh no, I've got the pitcher's mitt. Right, right, right. Darn it, darn it, darn it. All right, I think I can still do this. Maybe. Maybe. Oh! <laughs> I hope this has been a good episode for Crazy Brian Sounds. Because I do make some good panic noises, if I do say so myself. All right, if I do this, what happens? It does not set off any landmines. All right, Shopkeeper still hasn't seen me there. I still only have one bomb. Let's see. Let me... All right, there's Damsel Doggy. Oh, there's an alien over here. Oh, it's not a great spot for you, alien. Uh, the alien will actually come down after me here, and so I get the alien... Oh, the alien might be able to shoot the shopkeeper. Hello. Maybe the alien will be my friend. Yeah, go shoot the shopkeeper. He did not. Oh, no, he's got to shoot me! Oh, no! Oh! Okay, didn't shoot me. That's going off. Darn, darn, darn. All right, we did not get a shotgun. Uh, I do want to go to the mothership still, don't I? Or should I just go forward? I always fail at the mothership, so maybe it would be better to just go forward so that we can get... Mm. But I do love the mothership. Can I get into the mothership? Yes. All right, I'm going to do it. I don't have a gun of any sort. Uh, actually, was there a... Did one of the woolly mammoths on this level drop the ice gun? I don't think he did, actually. Yeah, and the ghost is about to arrive. All right, let's just head forward and see what fate has in store for us. I've only got one bomb, too. This is going to be ridiculous. Right, but I've forgotten. I can do this. Oops, that's not the right way to do it. I was trying to whip that thing. Because then it falls to the ground and you can pick it up and you can use it like a gun. This little turret. There we go. Okay, how does this work? Oh no, I threw it. How do you shoot it? Is there a way to shoot it? Um, I'm pretty sure there's a way to shoot it. But the B button throws it. Oh, it just shoots automatically. Okay, got it. Alright, so every few seconds, this thing's just gonna shoot automatically. Oh boy, here comes some telepathic rays. How often does it shoot? There we go. Okay. All right. I'm starting to get the hang of it. Oops. 
Yeah! Darn it, I was hoping it would fire already. Do your thing. Thank you. Alright, this guy gave me an alternative way up, so I'll take it. Great. Alright, this gun is not useless. It's not the most useful thing I've ever had, but it's not useless. It's way better than nothing. And hopefully we'll get up to a shopkeeper and the shopkeeper will kill himself somehow and that will be greatly to my advantage. That's what I'm hoping for here. Darn it. Oh no, there's another alien! Oh, get up, get up, get up, get up! Run, run, run! Run! Okay, pick this up. Alright, now things are just gonna get crazy. Oh boy! No! 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 Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up! Alright, we're still alive. I still have the one bomb. Oh, and the shopkeeper's out. Uh, and the shopkeeper- Yes! There's my shotgun! Oh, there's a shotgun! Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Here we go, here we go, here we go. And blood helps me, I forgot about that. Um, oh no! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Go, 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 go! Alright, shotgun's on the ground. I can get it, I can get it. Just wait for these things to go away. There we go, get the shotgun. Climb this wall. Shoot that. Great. Gotta shoot this- uh, nope, I gotta wait for the telepathic race. Uh, ghost is coming in 10 seconds, that's okay. We're doing okay, we got a shotgun. There we go. Alright. Shopkeeper dead, I think. Um, ghost is coming from which side? Oh boy! Can I shoot this thing? Yes! Okay, he's dead. Oh no! Uh, uh, the other telepathic race got me and I didn't see them coming because I was too focused on the guy on the left. Darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it. <laughs> Uh, I really think I'm getting better. Um, and then the ghost does a final attack. Um, that was really exciting. I am pleased at how long I managed to stay alive there. And yeah, hopefully that was very entertaining. I'm, I'm not unhappy at all with that. It was basically the long and the short of it. 179,000, 3-3, inside the mothership. Take a look at yesterday. Also 3-3, doing pretty well. Jay Sano probably has it on the pause screen and hasn't played yet. Yeah, so I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys are having a great day. And I'll see you again soon, hopefully, with more Spelunky. Bye-bye.